So if you've ever used a Veil in Window Manager, then you've probably heard of Wofi. So Wofi is this run program that's supposed to imitate a popular program called Rofi but works on Valent. I found out that Rofi actually has a Valent version and you don't need to do use this and there are many reasons why. So first of all, Rofi is a GTK app which means uh, it all depends on your GTK theme. So if you have a bad GTK theme, then Wofi is gonna look ugly. If you have a good GTK theme, then it's gonna look nice. So that's how Wofi is. It's not at all similar to Rofi in any way because if you open up Rofi, you can see how it looks way more prettier. This is a theme that I made. So Rofi has a whole lot of pre-installed theme as well and it's very well documented to be honest. It's very much more popular and today I'm gonna show you how you can get it working with Valent if you're using any Valent desktop environment or window manager. Doesn't really matter that much and so all you gotta do is just get this package called Wofi or Rofi Valent. Uh, since I'm on Arch Linux, I can just install it like this. It'll install. But if you're on another distro, then you might want to go to the GitHub repository. So just search for Rofi Valent GitHub and it should get you there. And here it is. I'll leave the link in the description. And then you know you can do regular uh, git clone and all that. But once you install it, this is just regular Rofi app launcher working in VLAN with all of its features just compatible with VLAN basically and this is what I use I was using Wofi until I found out about this and it's amazing so you should use it and now why you shouldn't use Wofi so I already said it's based on GTK not only that it's very ugly by default or even if you theme it so I have themed it so if I do dash s and then this you can see that this is a Wofi theme that I have made. It l makes it look a little bit better, but it still looks very ugly. That's why I use Rofi that much. And you also have a lot of more features with Rofi. For example, there's a window mode. So you can use it kind of like a alt tab menu or windows tab menu, whatever. And you have a D menu mode. So if I type Rofi dash D menu, then it doesn't really show anything. But if I combine it with a command like ls and then do this, then I can use it like a file manager right here. Or I could even use it as an emoji picker. I know that Wofi has this feature. It's an AUR package, I think. And so with all of this, this is just built-in features or official features. You have something like uh, Rofi that show calc. So this is the Rofi calculator. And we've got a bunch more modes here. And so this is Rofi and you should really be using it and you shouldn't use Rofi. So that's it for this video and bye bye.